These are my tools for making great PS2 tutorials. Let's do this. Hey guys, this is Versatile from Project Phoenix Media. So in today's video, we're going to do something different. We're going to do this neat proof of concept and testing where basically I have free boot on my fat PS2, but you could do this with a slim PS2 as well. And I want to know, can I use a SD card reader or micro SD card reader and play games that way? So what I have today is I have this um, SD card, memory card kind of reader, Targus. And here I have a micro SD card that is uh, eight gigabytes and I have one game pre-installed. And what I did is if you, if you don't know how to install games to USB in general, what I did was I made a DVD folder on a FAT32 formatted micro SD and put the game in there, assuming that it's four gigabytes or less, or you could use USB Extreme or USB Util to rip the games and put on the root of your USB device or memory card. So we're going to see if this works today, and the short answer is yes, but if you want to see how it works, let's keep on going. So what we're going to do is I tested this, and it works great with OPL 0.9.3, and I'm sure it's going to work great with lower versions as well. So what we're going to do is go to OPL. Let me show you my settings real quick here. So if I press uh, start, go to settings, here are my settings. Basically I have USB game fragmentation off, USB device start mode is auto, USB games as a default, press OK, save changes. And then let's go ahead and we see that my USB um, card reader is detected. So I'm going to go ahead and run the game. This is the Marvel vs. Capcom 2, works great. And we'll show you some uh, game performance in a little bit here. Okay, let's skip through the beginning here. To arcade mode. Pick some random characters. And let's do this. So this is a great solution. Maybe you don't have an external hard drive or a USB drive, or maybe those uh, devices you have are full. You can definitely use a, uh, an adapter like this if you have spare memory cards, so to speak, and use those, and you should be in good shape. I can't, I can't say if all memory card readers are compatible, so just if you have one laying around, just give it a try and test it out. So that's today's proof of concept video. If you guys have any nitpicky questions, leave a comment here on the YouTube page. I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Once again, thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.